Uh, hari ini saya ingin mengumumkan bahawa berikutan dengan uh, kenyataan WHO uh, untuk uh, menukarkan nama jangkitan wabak uh, selsema babi ini kepada infection influenza A H1N1 uh, kita Kementerian Kesihatan Malaysia uh, mematuhi uh, pengumuman ini dan saya berharap semua media masa dan orang ramai boleh menggunakan istilah influenza A H1N1 uh, untuk seragamkan istilah ini ini adalah kerana uh, menurut WHO uh, pada mulanya dijangka dan disangka bahawa uh, wabak ini di Uh, sebarkan oleh uh, ladang babi yang berdekatan dengan kampung di Mexico. Dan selepas uh, siasatan dibuat memang uh, bukan dan tidak uh, bukan melalui uh, kandang-kandang babi yang terletak di Mexico tersebut. wabak influenza AH1N1 ini uh, saya rasa ia uh, akan memudahkan laporan-laporan uh, dan uh, beritanya akan lebih tepat dan tidak akan memberi kebimbangan uh, kepada mana-mana pihak uh, we have one big mass scanner very sophisticated well, we uh, We get it from this uh, Ministry of Defense. You can help us. You know, they have a big one. They are helping us out. Mm -hmm. And we are putting in one more. Actually, we have two now. So there are two now. Uh, we have two now. One more is uh, in LCCD. Uh, in LCCD, we have one. LCCD. But in KLIA, we have two. We have two. Yeah. So it's at the international arrival. Right? International arrival, yes. So altogether three, yeah. Yes. How much is it? How much does it cost, sir? Oh, I because this is I don't have the figures with me. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, how many flights will will they be checking today? Um, today I'm not sure. Yesterday is 16 flight. Yesterday 16 flights. Yeah. Today I'm not sure. I don't have the figures here. But uh, I will also spot check most of these uh, places. I will spot check. I will also check on the. The quarantine hospital. I'll check on this uh, KLIA, and will ensure that uh, all system is on the move. Now you see when, uh, especially visitors and Malaysians uh, coming from those uh, affected areas. So they come back uh, in a plane or in the airport. They might not have the kind of symptom, so we might not be able to trace them. Uh, we might not be able to detect the symptom at the airport but if for their own personal satisfaction they can voluntarily uh, self-quarantine and monitor their own health health check that means to see the, whether they are uh, uh, they can also check with their doctors if they want to ensure that they are Uh, cleared of all this uh, infection. This is H1N1 infection. So this is more on self uh, voluntarily uh, move. We, we, we didn't impose this. No, we are just advising those who want to be sure of themselves that they are not affected because the symptom normally in seven days uh, all symptoms will be out. All kind of symptoms, you know, whether you cough or you got flu, you got fever. So normally within the seven days, you should be able to detect the symptom. So after seven days, then you are said you're quite, quite okay. You say that you're clear of all this, uh, uh, all this infection. Yeah, that's mean in uh, in that seven day, uh, should they go into the public area or they should control themselves? Yeah, they, they are more careful. They should be more careful, lah, with with. Uh, for, you see like, like last few days I'm very happy that a lot uh, a few of them come back from Mexico and, and US 
they voluntarily come to hospital. They just come and check, you know, to make sure that they are, you know, they are free for all this infection. So I, I hope that uh, all this voluntarily, uh, volunt voluntary action will be able to help us to maintain the zero uh, infection in this country. So even, even if there's any infections, we actually can, con can, can control it uh, at a very fast pace. You know. Oh, stand by. At the moment, we have 28 hospitals. The list of hospitals, you can get it from my website, Ministry of Health website, moh.gov.my. Uh, moh.gov.my, you can get the list from there. Uh, I would like to... Oh yeah, the list is with me here, 25, 28. After you can... Uh, the list is here. Perlis, Kedah, Pulau Pinang, Perak, all the state we have, Sabah, Sarawak, uh, example in Sarawak, we have three hospital Kuching, hospital Sibu, hospital Miri, hospital Bintulu, four hospitals in Sarawak. And Sabah, we have hospital Queen Elizabeth, hospital Sandakan, hospital Tawau, all uh, with uh, this quarantine uh, facilities. All of them is with quarantine facilities. Yeah.